What is up? Welcome back to a new vlog. So, honestly, this camera's gonna be a little bit shaky because I'm driving right now. Today is Saturday, and I'm hoping to post this tomorrow. That way, they're not like a week late. I'm gonna go to Alexa's house because she's gonna do my nails. I am so, so tired. Like, I woke up just a little bit ago, maybe like 20 minutes ago, 25 minutes ago, and I am still tired. Like, I feel like I haven't woken up fully yet. So, let's see. Let me walk you through my weekend and what I plan on doing, and you, watch me, fail to do it all. First is first, my car needs an oil change, like, immediately. <laughs> and I'm just not gonna do it. I can't. I don't have time for it. Not right now. Should have done it last weekend, but now I'm not gonna be able to, so... I think I'm gonna leave my car and Tristan will hopefully do it sometime. Uh, I, okay, let me explain something. So, I'm not gonna be here for two weeks. Like, I'm leaving for two weeks, that's why I can't do it. Oh, I already packed, so that's good. I got it done and over with. Really easy kind of packing. You just kind of threw a whole bunch of random shit in there. The other thing that I really need to work on while I'm gone is my homework. I'm gonna bring all my stuff to do my homework, but it's kind of stressful because by the time that I get there, I have to start two new classes. Oh, there's so much stuff to do. Fuck. <clears throat> down, yeah. I've been feeling so, I've been feeling so down, yeah. Can you tell me why? Can you tell me why? I'm down. Yeah. I just got home from the gym. I went for. Oh, this camera's about to die. I thought I changed the battery. What in the world? Hold up. You're alive again. My camera was about to die, but I got it charged. I have another battery that was fully charged. So, you're good now. The very first thing I like to do when I get home is turn on my candles. Okay, so this was really cool because I love candles and I have to have like candles burning in the house. Like, at least one candle constantly burning candles can get really expensive like they can really get really expensive depending on where you buy them sometimes I'll get them from the dollar store just because they're cheaper they're like five bucks and it's a pretty good size and they burn pretty well um, sometimes I've had issues with them but they're cheap um, sometimes I do get them from like either TJ Maxx or Marshalls the only problem with that is that finding a good candle because there's so many different brands but um, they normally carry really good brands, but sometimes they burn a little bit too quickly and they can get kind of expensive as well. They can be like 10 to $8. And if you're buying multiple at a time, it does add up. And if you're burning multiple a day, they start burning really quickly. And in a matter of a week or so, you have to go buy new ones. Um, or, you know, a couple weeks in, you have to buy new ones. And so it can get really expensive to get co to constantly get candles. I went to Marshall's the other day. No, not Marshall's. I went to Michael's. And Michael's does their 75% off Christmas because it's over. So at the end of the year, they mark everything 75% off. I have learned a lesson. And that is that to not buy anything right now during Christmas or when Christmas comes up to not buy anything and just wait till after Christmas is over because everything is just a thousand times cheaper and I always knew that but I get antsy and I have no patience and I just want to buy things right there and then and anyways I learned my lesson not to do that next year my point that I'm trying to make is that I went the other day to Michael's and they had the Christmas candles for a dollar fifty a dollar fifty so I got this and they burned really well I had some uh I had some Halloween ones that burned very well. They lasted me for a pretty long time. And so I saw that they were a dollar fifty. <sighs> and I got and I got all of those. There was probably a good like maybe 35 candles, maybe 40 candles, and I should have just bought all of them. Um, they would have lasted me a couple months, maybe like two or three months. Maybe like three or four months. I think about it every single day. I think about the opportunity I missed. I think about the chance me and those candles could have had. I need to sit down because my arm is hurting. <sighs> Where should I put you? I'm sorry, like I know this is a really bad angle, but I went to the gym. Here, I'll fix you. Okay, is that better? I went to the gym and I did shoulders. 
And so holding up the camera like that is just a no for me today because they are, they're just hurting, so no. I am obsessed with Euphoria right now. I mean, who isn't? Normally, I'll watch the episode twice. <laughs> it's sad, I know. I'll watch like the episode twice just because sometimes like, you know, you miss some stuff in the first episode. You're too excited. You watch it and then it ends and you're like, what just happened like that was like a lot to unload so i normally watch it twice sometimes again during the week just to recap you know because i like the show overall i like the vibes so i didn't do that with this last episode i think it was episode three and i haven't watched it and so i was thinking i was like man tomorrow episode four yeah episode i think episode four comes out I'm like, and I can't really remember what episode three was about. So I want to watch it again. Do a recap. Also, Fallout just came out with Jenna Ortega, and I really like her. It looks like a really good movie. Maddie Ziegler comes out on it too, and I don't know. I've heard really good things about it, so I need to check that out. Hopefully tonight, I'll probably watch it. I've been wanting to watch it. So now that we're just updating each other here, I want to come on. I hate this control so much. It takes forever to like. Look, I have to like press on things a thousand times. Um, I went to Alexa's, as I told you earlier, she did my nails and look how stinking cute these are. Yeah, I hope you can see, you can't see. Let me show you better. My light in here sucks and you can't really tell, but I'm gonna include a video in here that I um, took with my phone earlier and they just look so stinking pretty. Oh my gosh, I am obsessed. So beautiful, I'm so shaky. I took pre-workout, look at this. Yeah. But no, they're seriously so cute. They're so dainty. I just love them. It works out perfectly because it's the best of both worlds. She does my nails and I do her lashes. And it's like it just works. Because I'm going to tell you right now, I hate doing my nails so much. I'm just so lazy for all that. And it's like we have 10 fingers. I don't have time for all of that. And normally whenever I do my nails, I end up taking a really hot shower. And then the really hot water will just take care of it for me. But... Yeah, no, they don't look cute. And 90% of the time, I end up falling asleep. And then I get lines all over. So it's just a mess. I just don't like to do them. No, it, I just don't like it. I'll do my toes, but that's easier. And they always dry perfectly, so it's like, I'll do that. My nails, my hands, I can't. I just don't have patience. Now I don't have to go somewhere else, have my nails done because I can just go to her. Look how cute he looks. He fell asleep with his dirty toy. But he just farted and it smells so bad. He, ha he has some of the worst farts. Like it's terrible. I think his farts are smellier than Max's. And it's so gross. Every single time I sit here and watch TV and he falls asleep, he farts like at least a thousand times. So it always sinks so bad. It looks like a giant orange, but it doesn't taste like an orange. I forgot what it's called, but so good. And my favorite way to do it, some people eat these with um, uh, sugar, but I don't like doing that. I've always liked salt on them first. Actually, I always ate them with salt. Recently, because I have this, I just like to add this to it. Um, it's just a little bit spicy. Might be wondering, how do we eat it? Well, let me show you. And then I like to just squeeze on in there. And it gets messy because it squirts everywhere. <laughs> I hate that word. Ugh. So good. And then it goes like this. These are so... Good. and if you've never tried them now you can apparently this is how my videos are just ending every single night now in the kitchen i just finished watching fallout and it was pretty good for what i saw i didn't watch it all like i watched it but i wasn't paying much attention but it looks pretty good it looks really good i do want to watch it again and actually pay attention this time because i missed a lot of parts Because I have a dis. No. Oh, thank goodness. Um, I have a mess in here and I need to clean up a little bit before I go to bed because tomorrow I don't want to do it. But first, I'm going to put some music on. Some tunes. You don't even want to know the time right now. Okay, I'll tell you. It's 2.34.
Anyways, I can clean up in like 10 minutes, but I'm just Okay, I love Heather. Pause. Pause, Tar Tarek, or whatever your name is. Pause. So, I love Selling Sunset. And I love Heather. She's just so cute. I love her. And Krishna. Everybody else can fuck off. Oh, no, Mary, too. I love her, too. She's cool. Oh, and Maya. Anyways, everybody else can suck it. But Heather's fucking crazy. She moves so fucking quick. It is crazy. Ew, what is that? This woman. They moved in on their fourth day. What is going on? I love her and I think she's so stinking cute. And I love that she loves love so much. And that she just loves to be loved. And she loves to be in love. And she believes in love. And she believes in love at first sight. And I love that about her. And it's so cute, you know? But like, oh my gosh. You move so quick. She's still so sweet, so she'll be okay. But at the end of the day, I think they are so cute together and I get good vibes from the guy Tarek. I don't know, I think he's a cool guy. And they both have really good senses of humor. They both have cute personalities and they're both just kind of down to earth. So I like them. They're concerning me right now, <laughs> for sure. And then we started looking at rings like three months in, but I think that was more to look at size. I was ready probably earlier on I need a little bit longer, closer to a year. And then three days after our one year anniversary, he proposed. Aww. I'm glad though that he knew he wanted to wait and he stuck true to oh that. Wait a minute, Tari. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Where he could have just given in and proposed just because she wanted to get married. Tari. I agree. I I see his point. Me standing up I love this. Okay, CEO this is really cute. I'm gonna have to put a pause on that because I have to go to sleep but in case you were wondering what the heck i was watching i was watching Tariq el mumuza moza moza i don't know and heather ray's like um wedding thing i don't know it's on people um it's on the people magazine channel on youtube and they're just basically talking about like their engagement and like how they met and like their whole freaking thing. It's really cute. I finished cleaning, kind of just picking up, but then it's going to be it for me today. I hope you guys enjoyed my TED talk. Bye.